So, I mean, from this reaction, from the proton-proton interaction, you end up, primarily you get muons. Oh, well, you'll get some pions. Primarily pions are the ones that, that interest me the most. There's, there's positive ones, negative ones, and neutral ones. The neutral ones with no charge, they immediately decay into two gamma rays, which is usually what we see. So there's a whole chart of what's going on there that you need to be fluent in. Otherwise, you don't know what the hell is going on. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, remind us about muons, because I'm fascinated that they exist at all. Yeah, because they're, they're very short-lived. And so there's, this is one of these Wait, interesting- Can you quantify that sh short-lived? Can I quantify that? I mean, short-lived a few seconds, a few microseconds. Way smaller, way, way faster. Even than shorter that. than that, yeah, okay. Yeah. Right. In fact, the time it takes a, a, a muon to reach the surface of the Earth from space, from, from the atmosphere, where they're created by these cosmic rays hitting the atmosphere, they shouldn't live to get to the surface. Traveling at almost the speed of light, they shouldn't make it. And yet they do. Huh. And this was they one. They should have decayed before yeah, they yeah. I was going to say they're, they're yeah, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the trick is that they're traveling so fast that their clock's at a different speed than ours. Oh, that's amazing. Ain't that yeah. some stuff? So you have muons in your exotic places in the universe. Mm -hmm. But I hear that we also detect muons here on Earth. Oh, yeah. So what's going on there? So you'll get one of these energetic cosmic rays will come in and hit something in our atmosphere. So it's the same phenomenon. Exactly it, the same. Right. Yep. But, but that's fact, happening to us. The Earth's atmosphere is a bright, bright gamma ray background, in fact. So wow. um, the, the, that particle shower, these extensive air showers. Because it busted open the mm -hmm. proton. Right. Okay. They'll, they'll come flying in, and those muons will sh stream down to the surface. A thousand just went through your body. Wow. An mm. Another <laughs> another thousand. Oh. <laughs> oh. Another thousand. <laughs> <laughs> but the interesting thing is their, their lifetime is so short that they shouldn't make it. That trip from the top of the atmosphere down to here, they should decay they before They should decay that. before they hit, Long the, before yeah. they hit, the, before they hit yeah. the earth. Then why do they make it? Well, because they're traveling so fast that their clock is running at a different speed than ours. That's amazing. So they actually don't know any better. <laughs> so Einstein was right. I, uh, so, so it's relative time dilation. The time, yeah. time dilation yeah. right here on Earth.